Hey guys and welcome to Rosa Scale. So the news about the GPT-40 is out and this is a new model called Omni. I won't be going into much detail about the model itself. The most important three things that you need to know is that it's faster, it's 50% cheaper than GPT-4 Turbo and it has some enhanced capabilities in understanding audio and visuals. But today we'll be testing the SEO components of the model. We'll be running my famous sequence prompt to see how long of an output we are going to get. And also just recently we've run huge experiments when we compared all of the models inside of U.com. And now U.com has added GPT-4.0, so we will be able to see if the new model has any tangible improvements in terms of SEO. So we'll be looking at the word counts and how well GPT-4.0 follows these commands. We will be testing the one-click SEO prompt. We'll be seeing if uh, the model uses internal links and we'll be assessing readability levels as well as AI scores. So let's get started. First, I'm headed to U.com, uh, which now has GPT-4.0 as well as a whole suite of other models. And I'll be writing my famous sequence prompt to see just how long of an output we are going to get with this. For those of you unaware, this is a two-step process. First, we'll be generating some popular questions on the topic, and then we'll be treating each question as a separate article, adding them together in one giant piece of text. Okay, we are already at step four, and we have not once Click to continue, which is amazing. Okay, time to do just that. Go on. And I can tell you right now that this model is faster. Okay, this is the last step. I think we've only had to do the go on thingy three times so far. Now we can just copy everything except for the questions themselves. Let's see how many words this is. Okay. And this is 7,300 words. Wow. An easy 7,000 word output. Okay. Okay, so let's uh, run some of the prompts that I did for the rest of the models. Started with the word count following prompt. And this one is very easy. Generate a 2,000 word article about Ken Doxit Longan. Okay. And this is 1,300 words. So let me apply markdown formatting. So we'll get rid of some extra characters. Yeah. 1,318 words in total. Okay, now it's time to test our famous one click SEO prompt. This is the prompt, and I'll be making sure I'm uploading the links.txt file the prompt is referencing, which is basically my sitemap. And the prompt works off of a uh, outline, and then includes all of the relevant NLP keywords from NeuroWriter. Okay, I'm already seeing some links. Nice. A table. Another link. So we can already say yes for the links. And let's see how SEO optimized this is. Back to NeuroWriter. Let's paste this in. And the SEO score is 74. Wow. So 74 and yes to internal links. And 74 is one of the highest scores we've gotten. So this is comparable to GPT Turbo. Now let's apply the readability prompt. And this one is very easy as well. Write a 1000 word article about how to perform a one arm push up using simple English at a readability level of grade five. Okay, so the article is ready. Let's make sure this is following the correct formatting. And now let's go to Hemingway to see what... Wow! <laughs> oh, I have never seen that actually before. So this is grade 2 readability. And I have never seen anything of grade 2. And uh, it's very difficult to interpret this. So it is uh, the lowest readability level out of the all of the models but i was asking specifically for readability level 5 and here we are checking the ability of the llm to follow the prompt mm, interesting and for the final touch let's test this very article with originality 2.0 and unfortunately this is 0% original 0% so let's sum up the output is one of the longest outputs so only c command r beats this result and uh, if it wasn't for command R, this would have been number one. So I would have to color it like so. Then the SEO score is second highest again, second only to GPT-4 Turbo. Internal links, yes, readability level, I don't know how to interpret this. So I would have to give it a red since it did not follow the command, but <laughs> grade two readability is something. <laughs> and unfortunately did not pass AI. So an interesting model. I wouldn't say it's necessarily better than GPT-4 Turbo, but the output was twice as long. 
so this is interesting. And the SEO score was quite comparable, one of the highest. And I actually like the formatting of the article and grade 2 readability is always great. <laughs> so to sum up, this is a very potent model. I wouldn't say it's head and shoulders above all the rest, but it's an improvement of source, I would say. And yeah, hope you've enjoyed this little experiment. I love you guys, appreciate you guys, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.